everybody, thanks for tuning in to Comic TV. You know what time it is, it's my favorite day of the week. March 4th, 2020, New Comic Wednesday. I'm your host, Tony Varela, and this here, wearing a little Avengers wear, he's got the pants too. This is my co-host, Yogi Yogs. You ready to do this, Yogs? We got a lot of hot comics today. Whoosh, let's do it, all right. So uh, before I get started, I wanna tell you about uh, KRS Comics is going to be having the Catwoman 80th anniversary on sale from uh, Natalie Sanders. And ooh wee, this comic is beautiful. You're definitely gonna wanna get it. It goes on sale on Friday. Uh, they've also got the Mike Mayhew Psylocke variant as well. And that thing is sexy too. I've already got that on, on order. So I'll be showing it to you in the near future. So uh, coming out the gate today from Boom Studios, we got King of Nowhere. And I got this book because it looks like a Shel Silverstein cover. I don't know if you remember those books from when you were a child, but they were some of my favorites. Maxwell Prince is doing the writing on this book and we got Tyler Jenkins doing the art and cover on this. And also be on the lookout for the Christian Ward incentive cover as well. From Dynamite Comics, we got a cover by here, Vengeance of Vampirella. Thomas Snigowski is doing the writing on that, and we got Roberto Castro doing the art. Not a big, big fan of either, although it's not terrible, but I strictly bought it for this Lucio Perillo cover. Woo! Love that Perillo cover, Yogi. What do you think, buddy? Got another hot cover, and this is a hot new title from Image Comics, The Marked Number Five. I've been loving this book, and the art is great as well. So we got David Hine and Brian Haberlin doing the writing, and Haberlin's doing the art and a cover on this, and I got the J. Anacleto variant. Ooh, wee yogs, that's a sexy cover, right, brah? Oh, yeah. So sexy, I had to get it twice. Ooh, wee. Next up, another new title from Image. We got Mercy number one, and there's a ton of great covers for this book. That is written and drawn by Mirka Andolfo, and that is the Art Germ cover. Be on the lookout for the Jenny Friesen cover. I got that Virgin coming in the mail. Yes, I do, Yogi. And we also got a Natalie Sanders cover that's real beautiful as well, so check those out. Next up, Pandemica number four from Jonathan Mayberry. Uh, that's uh, drawn by Alex Sanchez, and he does the cover as well, and that title is really good. Very topical with the coronavirus and all that going around. Maybe possibly man-made virus, I don't know. I don't know, I'm just saying maybe. From Marvel, we got Black Cat number 10. Jed McKay's doing the writing on this book, and we got Chris Anka doing the art, and I bought it for this awesome Adi Granoff cover. And the J. Scott Cam Campbell regular cover was really nice with Black Cat and Wolverine on it, but I had to go with this Granoff because Spider-Woman and Spider uh, Black Cat are looking mighty sexy on that cover. One of my favorite titles going right now, we got Daredevil number 19, written by Chip Zdarsky. We got Marco Cicchetto back on the pencils and I absolutely love the pairing of these two. Tedesco's been killing it on the covers and we're gonna have some uh, crossbones and bullseye going ham in this issue. So can't wait, awesome book. Dr. Doom, this one started out really good, fell off, so I dropped the title, but I could not pass up this Mike Mayhew cover. Christopher Cantwell is doing the writing on this, and we got Salvador La Roca doing the art inside. Next up, we got Miles Morales, number 16. Solid and Ahmed's been doing a great job on this title. Love his writing style, and Corey Smith's pencils are freaking fantastic. And also, we got us a Javier Garon cover. That's real nice as well. Let me get rid of this stack. New title from Marvel. Tons of new first appearances in this book. I hope you're on it. Written by Scotty Young, great artist and writer. Humberto Ramos is doing the pencils inside from uh, Superior Spider-Man fame. And uh, this is the regular Ramos cover as well. And I was able to pick up the J. Scott Campbell variant. Also love that Campbell variant. So you're going to get the first appearance of Emily Blight. Uh, Doyle Dormammu, the son of Dormammu. We got Shaylee Moonpaddle and Zoe Laveau. Calvin Morse and Desi. So tons of first appearances in that book. All it takes is one of them to pop off for that to be a hot book. So I recommend you jump on it. Maybe jump on it twice. From DC Comics, we got Batman number 90, one of the biggest, hottest books going right now with the first appearance of Punchline in Year of the Villain number three. Also, we got the first full appearance and origin story 
of the designer. That is written by James Tinian, and thank God for him. Tom King was killing that book, just smothering it with sorriness. James Tinian brought it back to life, and Jorge Jimenez's art inside is freaking awesome. Cannot recommend this book highly enough. I got the regular cover, I got the Francesco Martina cover, and I got a freaking buttload of copies too. Ooh-wee, I hope you did too, because that book is hot on the eBay. Next up, from Gabrielle Delato, got Flash 750. Uh, various writers on this, various artists, uh, Manipool and Brett Booth uh, are a couple to point out. And uh, in this book, Irish becomes the Flash in an alternate reality. Spec book. Spec book, Yogi, what do you think? So, uh, Far Sector, number four. This is from last week. That's it for today's book. But I told you I was going to pick that one up. And N.K. Jemison's been doing a great job on this book. I absolutely love it. And I cannot say enough of Jamal Campbell. Definitely one of the comic world's hottest new artists right now. Him and Ryan Brown are just tearing up the place. Another one I said I'd show you is this Red Sonia. Betty and Veronica mis mismatch. That is the Dalton Back to the Future cover. We love that one, don't we? And uh, man, I don't follow this title, but this Catherine No Day cover of Chastity number four, I just can't stop staring at that. Super hot, super hot. I don't think Yogi likes wearing pants, so uh, woo! <laughs> so uh, next up, we got Door number three. This is the one at 25 Ryan Brown brand. I got this one for about $12 on the eBay. Nice price. And you've already seen this one in a previous episode. This is Atlantis Attacks number two. That's the Mona Chinese New Year variant. Man, uh, Chinese aren't having a very good New Year, I'll say that. Not at all. And I also picked this one up for a dollar. This is Marvel Age number 12. Love me that Mad Zek cover, and that is the first preview of the black costume for Spider-Man. And uh, last off, a couple of things you might want to consider on your comic buying ex uh, excursion today. Miss Marvel had a first appearance of a character called Amulet. Black Panther Agents of Wakanda number seven had the first Legion of Foom, which are space dragons. Uh, I don't know about that. And uh, Marvel number one, Alex Ross has been doing the story and cover on that book. Although I love the cover, the art inside just looked meh. So uh, I took a pass on that book. So remember, KRS Comics this Friday. Check out that Catwoman Natalie Sanders variant. Also use the coupon code Jim Mint for 15% off of that order, baby. Woo! We'll see you next time. Oh, remember to look down and hit that like button and subscribe and tell your friends, tell your kids, tell your wife to watch Comic TV every Wednesday for all the hottest comics and variant covers. We'll see you next time.